Okay, it's spring 2015, and we're here with another spectacular 6115 final project. Katie, introduce yourself and tell us what you made real loud. Okay, uh, hi, I'm Katie, and I made a laser guitar. So instead of strings, it has laser beams, and when you block one of the beams to the sensor, it'll check which fret you're holding down on the fret grid, and it'll play that note. So the fret grid is... Um, all the columns and rows are hooked up, so these are all hooked up to write ports and these are all hooked up to read ports. So if you make a contact, it will read the output, it continuously scans through them and will be able to tell which fret you're holding down, and then it'll change the tone based on which one you're holding down, which is pretty cool. That rocks. Yeah, so yeah, the 8255 cool. is all of the uh, sensing part, and then it will send that information over here to the PSOC. And then what the PSOC does is it takes the new change of string state, and there's a, every there's a timer interrupt, so every 100 microseconds it interrupts and it'll skip through um, a sign function table for each of the six strings based on like the different note and the different frequency that each string should be playing, and then it adds all those voltages up at the end. It also has like a coefficient that de decreases over time so that the sound fades out. It adds that up and it outputs it to the digital to analog, digital to analog converter, so the output of the PSOC is like the combination of the sound waves which is going through a speaker. That is ingenious, and I asked this already probably, but I'll ask again. You built that in the Cypress Engineering Design yeah, I Studio? Yeah, uh, I used the laser cutter right downstairs, so. That is fabulous. Yeah, you better play it a little. I have the beginning of Baba O'Reilly down in the <laughs> That's one of my favorites. Yeah, yeah, it's outstanding. That is ingenious, yeah, beautiful you. project. 